written unto, wrote unto me. And then he goes on to say it's not good for a man to touch a woman. Why would he even bring it up? That's right. Why would he even discuss That's right. it? That's right. He's bringing it up because obviously there was concern and there was an issue. Yeah. All right? And, 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 and keep in mind, the issue had to do with feelings, uh -huh. had to do with emotions, and, and had to do with, uh, 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 the Bible calls it fornication, had to do with so much issues that were going on that the Apostle Paul had to write concerning it. Uh -huh. And as he wrote concerning it, he said in verse 7, For I would that all men were even as myself. That's right. Amen. Yeah. Yeah. Amen. He said, I would that you were Emma, but God, but every man hath his proper gift of God. Yes. Everyone had that doesn't have the same ability. Y'all hearing me? Amen. Amen. Yes. There are some human beings that can't do without certain things. Amen. They got to have it. Yes. It might seem funny, but it's life, honey. Amen. Yes. It's, true. it's life. It's too true. There are some that just got to have it. They they have to learn to keep it in check. Amen. Because if you got to have so much and you don't have enough of God, there is a problem there. Yes, oh, yeah. All right. Is that right? Amen. Amen. The Bible will speak to you that you give yourself to fasting and prayer. Yes. Is that right? Amen. Give yourself to a time of fasting and prayer to hear from God. But the worst part, worst part, are abused relationships in the church. Do you know how many hurt, and I said before, hurt men and women? Too many hurt women focus on the past and bring it in the church. Too much of what happened to you in the past needs to stay in the past. If you belong to God, it needs to stay in the past. It might be in your memory, but if it's in your memory, there is also something in you should be called victorious right. if you got the Holy Ghost. Amen. Amen. Is that right? Amen. Because if the past is in your mind and you haven't released it, the Bible calls it a stronghold. Jesus. And if it's a stronghold, it has to be brought down by the power of God. Amen. Is that right? Every stronghold should be brought down by the authority of God Almighty. Amen. This is a testimony. I had it in my brain, but God has delivered me. Yeah, that is right. Thank you, Jesus. And it took a fight, but God has it. Let me tell you something. You want to know what I mean? If you don't get the victory, it'll pass on to your children. Amen. And when it passes on to your children, it is called familiar spirits. Oh, my Lord. Mm. You pass them on to your children. Jesus. Oh, Amen. How can you talk when you don't have any, you don't need natural children to be open understanding by God. Amen. Hallelujah. Amen. My Lord. God has to give that wisdom. Yes. 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 Praise the Lord. Yes. Woo! That's right. Yes. The spirit. Here's a bad thing. You got women and men trying to out-preach the pastor when he preaching. <laughs> you are out-preaching me before God even give it to me. And therefore, you have come up with the solution. The solution is God. You have to let God talk. God has to talk. Yeah. Is that right? Yeah, man. Here's a good example. You got couples who are to be married that got problems. Amen. You got couples that are to be married that got problems. And they got issues. You know why? I don't know why all the time. But you know why there are some issues? They have arguments themselves. They won't even speak to each other. And they ain't even married yet. <laughs> <Jesus>. Hello. Yes. <laughs> they won't even talk. Yes, Lord. Yes. They will walk and say, Pray now. Help us. Pray now. Yes, Pray to him and see her or see him. Won't even speak. That's the devil. Hallelujah. That's right. Amen. Amen. What it is. It is. Yes. That's right. Here's how you get victory. The devil 
God is trying to, sh the, the Lord is trying to show you what the future going to be like until you get victory from God. Here's the Bible. Look at the, um, the book, the book of Matthew chapter 18. The book of Ma Matthew chapter 18. I'm going to get one scripture here. In the book of Matthew, y'all didn't expect this. Yes, sir. In the book of Matthew. Uh -huh. I'm going to get back to Martha in a minute. In the book of Matthew chapter 18. I love this stuff. Right. The Bible said, then Peter said to him and said, Lord, how often shall I forgive till my brother sin against me and I forgive him till seven times? Look, how much am I going to keep putting up from him? Amen. How much am I going to keep putting up from her? Amen. He ain't changing. She not changing. I don't know if the Lord told me to be with you or not. Amen. I don't know if the Lord, you, I don't be know, if, particularly when you upset, you really start putting the Lord in your conversation. <laughs> <laughs> but if you both oh, smooth it over, you forgot about the Lord, because now you're eating dinner and eating fried chicken. <laughs> <laughs> God is not to be used conveniently. Thank you. Y'all hear what I'm saying? Lord Jesus. Let me explain who God is. Do you know that God saw you when he created Adam? He already saw you in 2013 when Adam never would have known what a cell phone was. God already saw you Amen. Amen. while he was breathing life into Adam. He saw you already. Hallelujah. Yes, he did. Yes, and while he was breathing life into Adam, he was still making a way out because he's omniscient, which means he knows everything. He knew Adam was going to fall, but he made a way out for him. Amen. Oh, yes, Thank you, did. Lord. Yes, That's the eternal God Almighty. God made a way out for him. Now, here's the point. In 2013, and he was already forming Adam and making a way out for him at the same time, he made a way out for you too. Uh -huh. right. uh -huh. And the thing that you got to do is yes, trust in the Lord. Yeah. Yeah. All right. Lean not to your own understanding. Yes. Yes. Yes, Lord. All that way. Yes, Lord. Acknowledge him. Yes, Lord. Glory to God. Yes, Lord. When you acknowledge him, the Bible said he'll do what? Yes. He'll direct your path. The brother got a testimony in his wife 50 years. That's a testimony. Yes. Yes. Now, not the years. Because he could have died in a car wreck. Hello. It wouldn't have been a 50 years. Y'all hear what I'm saying? Yes, sir. God only blessed to give a testimony. Uh, <laughs> uh, <laughs> uh, While you lay up in the hospital, can't move, uh, and somebody taking care, God already saw a 50-year celebration. Uh, yes, he did. Uh, and he's using it for a testimony yes. to give God the glory. Uh, That's what God wants. Yeah. God got to say, God be some witnesses. Yes, now give God the glory. Amen. Give God the glory. Oh. Lord, I glory you. I thank you, thank you Lord, Amen. for what you have done. That's right. I give you all the glory. Because you are mighty good God. Yes. Yes, you the glory. Thank you. You held it. See, I can preach it. Because I know what it's like not to have that testimony. Hello, but I can still keep right on preaching though. How can you preach? There was one by the name of Hosea. Y'all hear what I'm saying? God told Hosea to get yourself a nasty woman. I call it nasty woman. Y'all hear what I'm saying? And and, and 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 as a result, they're having children, but he don't even know if they're his or not. But then God said to him, go back and love her. Uh, After she did all that to you, you go back and love her anyway. And he said the same way that you have to go back and love her, that's how you can understand how much I love my people. All right. Amen. And why I chose you? Because I decided to do it. 
Jesus. Yeah, you man. can't even question it. Yeah. All you can do is just go ahead and prophesy. Yeah. Yes. Because I'm God and I willed it, I said it, and whatever I say is settled. Yeah, man. So God has all the glory. So yeah. here's the problem. He said, Peter, uh -huh. he said, Lord, uh -huh. how often shall my brother sin against me? Yeah. I forgive him till seven times. Yeah. One thirty. Till seven times. Uh -huh. Jesus said to him, I say not unto thee until seven times, but until 70 times seven. He is not speaking of a number. His idea is not a number. But his idea is to say that God, your father, will always forgive you. When it comes from your heart, you should do the same. Amen. Yes. Yes. Amen. Yes. Just like God keeps forgiving you, that's right. You should do the same thing. That's right. that's right. So a husband yeah. should forgive his wife. Yeah. Wife should forgive a husband. His spouse should forgive. If you're a spouse, you should still forgive. Amen. The saints should forgive one another. Amen. Is that right? Amen. You should love one another so much. Amen. I mean, I tell you, yes. you can when people love each other yes. Yes. and you can see when they don't love each other yes. but when your tongue is loose and you're busy body yes. and you're gossiping you're using the telephone as a weapon of evil you're using the cell phones as a weapon of evil you're using just the church as a weapon of evil the church demons and devils being brought into the house of God Thank be to God, I ain't afraid of a demon in the house. Yes. Not when I can go ahead and preach that word. Yes. Oh, demon yes. don't have no victory in God's house. Yes. Y'all hear me? Yes. Yes. Right. Oh, no, sir. Yes. This is the kind of victory you take on your job. Yes. You take it from here. You walk out victorious. Yes, sir. Yes. Start speaking to one another. Amen. Yeah. Some of us sitting in church won't even speak to certain people. Come on. Come on. Amen. Amen. Hallelujah. You won't even talk to certain people. Amen. Hallelujah. Hallelujah. You, you, all, you got strife one with the other. Come on, somebody. Amen. 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 But here is the part. Glory to God Almighty. Thank you, Lord. While you got strife with one another, Jesus. and God was forming Adam. He still saw you. Amen. <laughs> Amen. He saw you even during the strife. Amen. Glory to God. But he decided to keep you alive. To hear God talk. But you can't go in the closet and shut the door if you got strife in your heart. 
Amen. Oh, get somebody else. Amen. That you call your brother and sister. Hallelujah. You can do it. Hallelujah. And you wonder why you're not getting the victory? Because you got stuff in your own heart. Amen. Amen. You got to get free from that. Yes, man. There's some people who can't get victory again. There's some people who can't get some victory. Yeah. Uh -huh. I don't know who you are. But God got some people in here that can get victory. Yeah, yeah. Y'all might not want to hear this part. Yeah, yeah. Right. Hear it. He said, he said, he he talking to Peter and he talking to the disciples. He said, Lord, he said, seven times seven. There's the kingdom of heaven. Likened unto a certain king, That's which right. is the Lord, God, which would take account of his servants. Uh -huh. Take account of his servant. <clears throat> and then the Bible says here, and when he had begun to reckon, one was brought unto him which owed him 10,000 talents. Amen. He knew he couldn't pay that back. Sure, that's right. uh -huh. How could he pay it back? Mm -hmm. There was no way to pay it back. Jesus. Huh? Mm -hmm. No way. It was too much money. How are you going to be paying it back? He said, but he said, for as much as he had not to pay, his Lord commanded him to be sold and his wife and children and all that he had and payment to be made. Uh -huh. The Bible said the servant therefore fell down and worshipped him saying, Lord, uh -huh. have patience with me. Uh -huh. And I will pay you all mm -hmm. if you have patience with me. Mm How -hmm. I many of y'all ever did that sometime? Mm -hmm. He said, God, have patience with me. Please, have patience with me in my relationship. Have patience with me in the church. Mm -hmm. I keep, well, I keep trying to talk to them and they won't listen. Okay. Bible's got some answers for that. The deacon talked about that earlier. But still, you have to have a clean heart. Yes. That's right. Your heart's got to be clean. Right. You can't have strife in your heart. <laughs> When a marriage takes place, it is symbolic of Christ's reference to the church and the church triumphant. All right. It is. All right. Yes. It is it's symbolic of that. You can even read it in uh, Revelations too. And so it's the marriage supper of the land. You can read about the virgins and all that, but in Revelation you can read. And he said, you when you come together. It is a relationship where God looks for his bride, his bride whom he loves, adorned, ready for him. Is that right? He never gets bored with his bride. He never gets tired of his bride. He never will just throw away his bride. He will keep loving his bride. Is that right? Amen. So in the house of God, there is a special love. Yes. When we love one another. Yes. Each one of us has a position. Amen. And it doesn't mean that your position is greater. That's right. That's you all co-workers together. Yes. yes. Is that right? That's right. God, when God blessed, he gonna bless everybody. When you go to heaven, it's not one, one, there, one. Everybody's going together. Wow. Right. Right. They will rise first. Yes. 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 We which are alive will be caught up with them. Together. Amen. With them. With them. That's right. So we go, we go with them. With Hallelujah. them to be with the Lord. Hallelujah. Yes. Not separate. Mm -hmm. Is that right? Amen. Amen. God wants his people to forgive one another. Amen. You gotta find it. It's a demon that's breaking. Heart yes. To not release you Amen. from what's in your heart. All right. Lord, no. All right. Hear it. Amen. God has to release it That's right. so you can love. Oh, yes. I love the people of God. Yes. Even those, and God is teaching me to preach this from example. When preachers are slandering me, I keep right on loving them. Yeah. Amen. Right. Keep right on loving them. Amen. When they're using all kinds of stuff to destroy me completely. But I keep right on loving it. Amen. And the more I see the preachers doing it, the hand of God is open 
opening up door after door after door. Hallelujah. 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 Hall